Hello everybody, welcome back to Open Bear Club Plays Amnesia, and I just remembered where I was. Okay. Okay, the shadow is roaring at me, there's goop everywhere. Uh, right, the water monster is right there, isn't he? And I have no idea where I need to go. Well, um, when in doubt, follow right. So this way. This is definitely the water monster chase music. Yeah. So there's nothing back here but boxes I can't even manipulate. So I just gotta dash around hoping until I find something. Oh my, oh my. Right off the bat. Okay. Sprinting! Yep, yeah, it. Oh, the music turns on when she chases me and turns off when doesn't know where I am. Well, that's. That's useful, actually. So. It's useful. Getting eaten by this thing is not on my list of priorities for this episode. Okay, that was just a foul. I've already... I've already done, right? I've done this one? Yeah, I've done this one. Okay, right, I've, I've done all... Shit. Crap. Out of the water. Out of the water! I don't know where it is. Out of the water. Ah. Okay, uh... God. It's going to eat me. Because I'm terrible at games! Ah, I can't get up there apparently. There it is! There it is! I seize it. I saw it. Jump! Okay. Uh Right, that's how you get over there with the bridge. No. Oh, that's right. Daniel can't climb this because he sucks at climbing despite being able to throw around boulders and support columns and crap. And he sucks at jumping. Maybe I suck at jumping. Maybe I'm just bad at games. Maybe, maybe not. No, I'm just bad at games. Oh man, it's getting close every time I screw up. Oh, this is. With the shadow shut up, I have enough. To, I have enough on my plate here. With Daniel's crappy ass not climbing, my crappy ass jumping. This reason. I, there's a reason I don't play platformers. My camera having trouble focusing. Yes, it is. Sorry about that. No idea. Crap. Around the pillar. Around the pillar. This way. Up. Uh, Up. Uh. Okay. Crap. No. This way I don't play platformer. This way I. Yeah. Okay. See if I can do this right. Up. Uh. And yep. And yep. There we go. See, I can do this sometimes. Yeah, I know you're angry. Quite already. Okay, so that thing, uh, there's the noise stopped, which means they probably drowned whatever was in here, and that's why everything's angry at me. Uh, follow the right wall. Really hoping this leads somewhere, and it doesn't just leave my being eaten. This is this, be, this would appear to be a dead end. Where is it? I hear it angry. Oh crap! This is quickly devolving something very. Uh, this was quickly devolving. This is already something very, very bad. It's devolving into something much worse. I really just need a way out of here. The way I went won't get me. The way I came from won't get me back. Oh crap. I need to be looking up. Is there something up I'm missing? Doesn't look like it. Okay, let's head back around. Uh, keep following the right wall until I find something of use, maybe. Light torches to know where I've been. Okay, uh, now what's this way? Have I been this way? Crap. Keep going, keep going, faster. Up! Oh, damn. Okay, up here. Uh, wait, how do I... Something down that way? There's obviously a... Uh, how do I get up here? Where is it? I get up over here, okay. Yeah, I... At least I'm dodging the water monster well enough. I'm spending enough time out of the water moving around that I was just having trouble keeping up. Which is a good thing, I suppose. Okay, there was nothing. There was just attached to a chain hanging from a pipe, I suppose. Something. 
Oh, got more jumping. Yeah, I almost missed that. Okay, please tell me there's something this way. I really want to be out of here. Uh, there's that one, there's this. Nope, not this way. Yes, I heard you. Shut up, you're angry, I get it. Oh, do I need to... Do I need to get through here? I don't know. Don't budge. What does that mean? That it, it's just stuck, or can I? Is this a puzzle? Is this a puzzle? I'm not sure. Well, let's keep following right for now. I. Oh man! Oh man! Oh man! Oh man! Hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait. No, okay. Nope. I almost thought I might have seen something, but nope. And this is the way I came from. Ah, crap, I'm missing something again. Uh. I'm terrible at this, aren't I? To be honest. Mm. Wait, is there a... There's a... There's a... I, um... A bridge of goop over there. Can I use it to get back to the door? Did the shadow inadvertently give me a way out? Across here? Yes! Okay! I just wasn't looking properly! I need to be more observant. Alexander knew there must be a way to finish the ritual before it was too late. He had to teach his friend the harvest to bite that much was certain. Okay, Alexander is teaching Daniel how to form horrible, horrible cultist rituals. Okay, and I'm back here. What did I accomplish in there? What did I actually do? I, I killed something and pissed other things off. Okay, time to go this way then. Oh yes, the morgue. The red taint for I've read that already. More shadow goop bursting from walls. Ah, uh, yep, yep, yep. Come on, load. There we go. Okay, I I've at least gone out there with most. Uh, well, that's what, about half? I mean, a good number of tinder boxes. Oh, uh, this looks like a really good place to get ambushed. I, I have chains. Okay, yeah. This is a really good place to get ambushed. I say ambushed like it's... That's a naked dead guy. Hello, naked dead guy. I hear you breathing down Whoa. Hi. Can you hear me? There's no flashback. Your life? Um, hi Alexander. You're being creepy. Okay, here's a note. <coughs> the strange deaths among the servants and the prisoners have finally been resolved. It seems that a drain here which has recently been opened up for use as a means of transport is plagued by a peculiar poisonous fungi. The victims seem to have suffered an extremely quick outbreak of sickness affecting the entire body. Some of my men, including myself, are blissfully scared by this calamity, but it is clear that this cripples my progress. The prisoners die quickly, and their contaminated vitae lacks the energy I seek. I shall immediately start working on a vaccine. Okay, so... I think I navigated that area without too much issue, although I still have no idea what I actually accomplished there. Okay, I'm starting to see pieces of a puzzle here. Uh it's still a really good place to get ambushed. The vaccine enabling women to work in the fungi ridden sewer is a definite success. Unfortunately, only a few of the servants have been remedied as the procedure proved difficult. The others will perish, and eventually I will have to create more of them to keep my create more of them to keep my experiments running. Note that an injection of vaccinated blood will work as a shield long enough to pass the sewer without any risk of infection. It will do fine prisoner transport. Ah. One, create. Two, 
to an injection of vaccinated Now Now I'm doing this thing with that I fear for Daniel for he is reckless So this is not Daniel's thought, this is something else's thought I'm talking about Daniel Okay he is tainted by the approaching shadow and will not be able to pass the gate. Will he be able to accept this in the end? My love, I've seen evil in him. How am I to trust him with the truth? A cruel irony that I have to do on him what Agrippa did unto me. Okay. Uh. Ooh, laudanum. That would be useful. More tinder boxes. I really need to use those more. I stockpile them and never use them. I use my oil too much, but right now this is fairly well lit. Hold on, hold on. Agrippa. Yes, I've heard that before in here. He was one of... Nope. He was one of the research... <sighs> okay. Anyway, Agrippa was one of the researchers working with Alexander, wasn't he? Okay. Uh, just lots of naked dead guys. Any... Do I need... Oh, lots of blood splatter. Do I need anything in here? I'm really gonna have to prick the body and inject myself with his blood, aren't I? Is there anything else I need to do in here? Okay, some of these are head first, some of these are feet first. They're all very, very naked. What? what? How is. Alexander's such a terrible person, he can't leave them with some clothes. He has to expose others to their nudity. Not only is there a room with dead people, there's a room with dead naked people. Is that really really necessary, Alexander, is it? Apparently so. Yes, he ain't answering me. Alright, time to break myself with the needle. Well. Okay. Uh why the skull? The jar? There's something missing. There's something missing. Some... I missed something. I missed something in one of these rooms. Or that whole area I was supposed to collect something and I missed it. That would be just lovely women. Uh, wait. Did the drill break? The drill broke, piercing his skull. Didn't it drill through much tougher stuff earlier? Whatever, I found it in pieces to begin with. I suppose it shouldn't be too surprised. So what's missing? That, I imagine that, is not going to keep blading forever. Or maybe it will. Uh, why do I have my locker open in here? can't be older than a day. Okay, so it is fresh. And I got a note. Journal. No, that's not what I need. Limitos? Okay, yes, I get what I need to do, but I'm apparently missing something. What am I missing? <laughs> what am I missing? What am I missing here? Bookshelves, nothing on the bookshelves. I'm gonna bet it's something I need to find in the other room and missed in my frenzy of getting the hell out of there. There you go. Just to be clear, there's nothing in this room. It is just a pile of naked, dead, bloody bodies. Just keep bleeding forever, isn't it? Wait, what is that on the floor? Oh, it's a pile of dead rats, is what it is. Oh, right. Alexander did his crap on animals, too. I mean, I. I sh I should be, I probably should be more shocked at that, but honestly, I don't get the people who are like, oh my god, not just people, but animals, he's a cool. I'm not trying to say people are more important than animals, I honestly don't know what I'm trying to say here, but I don't think murdering people should be lessened because he also murders animals. Does that make any sort of sense? I have no idea. <sighs> Crap. 
fact that it was down there, wasn't it? Or I'm overlooking it. Because I do that. Not intentionally, but I do that a lot. Okay, the, the, these rooms have to matter somehow. Do I... Commission does not work. Commission does not work. Probably necessary. Oh, do I have to go back in there? I... What's up here? Is there another way? Did I miss a way? Uh, wait, wait. There was another way. That's where it came from. So what's down here? What is down here? That's a good question. More dead... Well, skeletons. Well, flashbacks. What? What happened? What's that? Copper tube? What's happening? Help! Anybody? Help! Wilhelm, this is your doing again, isn't it? Seriously, this is Daniel and Alexander's story, but I want to hear more about Wilhelm's story. There we go. Because, I mean, yeah, he was a. But. Yeah, okay. Um. Oh crap, he tried to claw his way out through the wood. Well, I imagine a lot of these people did. Anyway, Wilhelm obviously had family. I mean, he was an important noble person. I, I, I do want to hear more about him, but I don't think I'm going to get any. I mean, yes, he was an awful person in the end, but... What was he striving for? I mean, even the most corrupt can have good intentions. So what made Wilhelm the way he was? Can I... Okay, apparently a needle and a copper tube makes a syringe. Uh, I'm not going to question the logic of that too hard because I found the puzzle. Oh, that is... Ah. Ow. Oh. Ew. Really, ew. Okay, so apparently I'm done here. Bro! That's what these rooms are for! They're for hiding. These rooms are for hiding. I knew they had to have a purpose. I'm hiding. Is he trying to break in? I can't see anything. That does not sound like Bruce. That's the new, that's the other one. There's another one. That's not Bruce. Sounds like a constipated whale. Doesn't it? I, I, I mean, yes, it's freaky as hell, but actually really listening to the sound without the music stuff. Sounds like a constipated whale. Uh, did it leave? Was that it? Did I hide from it all super skillfully? No, I still hear it. Take a peek. Whoa! My Sandy is going down. Am I gonna die from sand loss? Crap, do I have anything? I do not. Get some light. Bring myself back up. Okay, let's try this again. Do I see him? No? He left? Is he gone? Whatever he is? Uh, he's on like a well. We'll call him Beluga. How's that? Nah. Stupid. Uh, sure, let's just call him Humpback. I have no idea what he looks like, but it might fit. Oh uh, yeah, I'm just gonna creep through this door over here. I'm not gonna go looking for him to find out what he looks like. Really rather not. 
This beautiful wild orchid seemed a testament to nature's strength. I've read that already. Uh, being able to grow inside Brandenburg, Alaska, with Alexander studying his care, which enabled the flower to blossom. The wild orchid is the one that grows around death, right? And rotting things, right? I don't know flowers that well, so correct me if I'm wrong, but I think that's what they are. Okay, so I injected myself with a dead person's blood that may or may not have actually contained the the um, anti-venom. Uh, we're gonna find out? Oh man, that's just kind of... Uh, it's not scary so much as squicky. Like the guts. A lot like the guts. Uh, some skin just goes for... Oh, that's what the other room was for. Drain the water from this. Wow. Oh. But yeah, like the guts. Sometimes this game doesn't go for scare, it just goes for squick. And, I mean, that's fine, it's just... Oh. Henry Bedenlow went to class carrying the anger of his better mother. He never cried, he made others cry instead. Pain is like that, either you become sad or you become angry. Henry always showed the latter. Puzzle completion, apparently. Well, that's nice. I actually really needed that. I almost lost from sand earlier, and now I only have a slight headache. Okay, uh, progress. Okay, yeah, this game is really balancing itself well in the long run. I've had some... I had that one episode where I was really, really quiet, but I had a bunch of scares beforehand. I could have done them in different orders, so I may have just gone in a really unconventional order and got all the scares and all the pause instead of them spacing out. But yeah, the game is doing better. My complaints from the... was it episode 5? Episode 6? Somewhere around there. My complaints for that are... still valid for that... Portion, but overall the game's been doing a lot better for that. Um, again, this atmosphere is fantastic. I see why so many horror games try to do what Amnesia does because it does it really, really well. I still haven't seen the second monster. I'm not sure if I'm actually going to call him Beluga or Humpback or come up with a name later. I'll probably I might give him a person name. Who knows? If you want to throw names in the comments, feel free. Okay, um, so, yeah, Squick. I, I was talking about that earlier. Well, that just a moment ago, actually. Okay. Like the guts, the blood is really, really squicky. It's one of those really nasty things you probably have to, you pro have to do to survive, and the guts were just, guts were just kind of there. But it's still was something I was actively participating in, and just kind of compounded that. I mean, the first part, it just threw me in the fear. I didn't have time to build up, so I maybe wasn't as scared as I was, could be. I mean, I had I was really freaking out, but I wasn't deeply terrified. I don't... After that was the puzzle, and I just had to find the part, and then I could figure out the pieces. And apparently, the head would just leave forever. I mean, game mechanics. It, That being a timer thing, just, oh, you took too long, you lose, kind of, would kind of not be fair, especially when you're dealing with, dealing with the puzzle where you have to final piece and figure it out. But it kind of broke immersion slightly. I'm not sure how I would fix that, but that is a slight criticism I have. Besides the puzzle itself, the idea that you, that I have to inject myself with the dead person's blood and I don't even know if they'll work or not, I'm going to go find out if I get poisoned and die or not. That concept is really good really, really good. Again, I am loving this game so far. It is scaring the pants off me, so to speak. One other matter. I missed one of my videos. My uh, The video I would have put out on uh, November say the 17th, so that would have been Friday the 15th? Friday the 16th? Right around there? I'm gonna put an extra amnesia up, I think Saturday, um, maybe Sunday morning. I'm really sorry I missed the video, I got completely preoccupied with something else, it is entirely my own fault and I apologize profusely. I really don't, I really want the channel to be something more than just me playing games, but if I want to do that I first need to, you know, play games, be entertaining, make, maintain a solid schedule. If I can't maintain a solid schedule, I'm not going to get anywhere else. So, boat, 
to anyone who cares and to myself. I'm apologizing. I, I really feel the need to. And I'd really like to be to do better at that. I'm considering doing uh, just kind of a silly bonus video. Just to... I'm not sure how to phrase this. Not exactly to make it up, but just to do something random and silly, something lighthearted. I'm not sure what to do. I have a couple of ideas, but I'm looking for more. If you guys want to post anything just random and silly you guys want to see me do in the comments, feel free. Or email me, or I don't really check Facebook or Twitter as much as I probably should, but if you post it there, I'll find it eventually. I usually get email saying, hey, someone posted on your Facebook wall, etc. So I'm sure you know how all of that works. Uh, I felt like there was something else I wanted to talk about here, but I can't remember it because I'm still, my heart's still racing, so I'm really freaked out. Okay, uh, if I remember it later, I'll throw it in the beginning of the next video or add a post commentary. Uh, this has been Oak and Barracle. I'll play some Nija. This was part 11. 11, really? Huh, I'm actually getting pretty far in this. I haven't quit or. Okay, yes. Anyway, this has been part 11. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next part, where I see if I died of venomous fungi. Was this fungi? Whatever.